Hi, Sarah Bendrick here. I'm going to show you guys how to put a hole in the bottom of a ceramic container. I picked up this beauty at a pottery place. I really love it. It's beautiful, but it has no drainage hole. And since I'm sticking succulents in it, it's going to be really important for me to have that drainage. Succulents do not like wet feet. No plants like wet feet unless they're aquatic. So every container should have a drainage hole if you're sticking plants in it, as far as I'm concerned. So um, I want to stick a hole right in the center. I'm going to use a half inch drill bit. You can pick one up for like 15, 20 bucks. It looks like an iron attached to a stick. Basically, we're just gonna drill one hole at the bottom. Half inch, I think is great for this size. If it was a much larger container, I would still use the half inch, but I would do probably three holes on the bottom. So um, most importantly, when drilling through ceramic, make sure you have a container of water because the water is gonna cool down the drill bit. You wanna dip it in the water every few seconds, every few minutes, kinda just depends on how quick you're drilling through. Take your time. You wanna take your time because you don't wanna break this. You don't want this to get so hot because ceramic, especially glazed ceramic, is expensive. So take your time, use the right bit, have some water. I just drill the hole through the pot I was supposed to show you how to do without hitting record. But anyways, <laughs> here's a freaking hole. <laughs> Alright, so I don't know how I forgot to hit record, but anyways, I drilled a hole <laughs> through my container so it's ready. Yay! But you still didn't get to see it. So, lucky for me, I found this container in my backyard that doesn't have a hole. I'll show you how to drill a hole through this one. Um, basically, find the center. I'm going to start with my blade just a little bit cool because I just drilled through this. It's still pretty warm. So I'm going to find the center. It's going to dance around a little bit, so I'll put a little bit of pressure to really help hold that um, down. There we go. So now I have it started. The bit shouldn't really dance around anymore. I'm putting a little bit of pressure on my blade just to make up for lack of arm muscle. Cleaning it off every once in a while. Now we have a hole. Thank God I found this pot because I would have felt really silly if I wasn't able to show you. Anyways, um, just like that. It's not really hard. I didn't put too much pressure, but just because uh, I'm strong, kind of, but having the extra hand there really helps me kind of put enough pressure to really um, pop through. So, yeah. Anyways, this is how you drill a hole through a ceramic container. Thanks for watching. Ciao.